Hello YouTubers, I'm in the process of making a comprehensive set of videos about thyroid health, hypothyroidism, Hashimoto's, etc. And I keep coming across this erroneous um, advice on the internet in various um, podcasts, blog posts, vlogs about if you have hypothyroidism or if you have Hashimoto's, then you should avoid cruciferous vegetables. Uh, and you hear this from many, many pseudo experts, uh, from chiropractors trying to practice a little outside of their scope, from uh, other people who have read just enough to be dangerous. There's a word for that. It's called sophomoric, you know, just enough to be dangerous. And in medicine, that can actually be dangerous. So you always have to watch out for that. So I, I looked into the studies on this on pubmed.gov. You're welcome to also look there. You can Google this and read for an hour and be smarter than the average doctor. So there is literally no research at all that shows definitively that someone with low thyroid, hypothyroid, subclinical hypothyroid, or Hashimoto's should avoid cruciferous vegetables. This all came about from a case study in which a little 80 pound woman uh, in Asia was eating three or four pounds a day of bok choy. Now, I'm sure she also had multiple other deficiencies, vitamins and minerals. Who knows the other um, aspects of her overall health? But, but somebody wrote up her case study. So that was a study of one person in one part of the world doing one unusual thing. She was eating pounds of cruciferous vegetables every day and she was a very petite woman to start with. And so based on that the doc said, hmm, that's weird. Maybe that contributed to, um, to her problem. You can't make any medical decision based on that one case study. Um, all the other studies, there was a, a Greek study of children who had been supplemented with iodine uh, that's also, you can't, it's, it's not any kind of definitive study you can use to make any decision on. So as long as you're eating less than three pounds a day of cruciferous vegetables, you're fine. Okay. So eat your broccoli, eat your cauliflower, eat your asparagus, Brussels sprouts. Don't be afraid of cruciferous vegetables. They are literally a gift from the creator. They're full of nutrition. Do not be afraid of them. Now, if you enjoyed this short video, please click subscribe. Share this on your social media so that we can get this word out there to everyone with Hashimoto's who's currently afraid to eat cruciferous vegetables because they need to know that's fine. That's great nutrition. Don't be afraid of cruciferous vegetables.